Hello everybody at Toro Magazine, Fabio Viviani here and uh, what we are making right now it's something that is in need of a meat mallet. There is some meat that is about to be tenderized. We are making some pork cutlet. Pork Milanese. Milanese is the name you would give to this dish when we are in Italy. It's a little pork scallopini. It's a man dish, because the pork is fried, and then there is a salad of arugula, tomato, and parmesan. Great for boys, but also very easy to make if you're a lady, because there is no good in being a man if there is no ladies around. Now, the dish is super simple. Like every other recipe in my cookbook, Fabio's Italian Kitchen, this is meant to be done in a few minutes, and is meant to be enjoyed with friends and family. So, all I am suggesting you to do is to stretch your dollar by pounding the scallopini. Not only you will amplify the surface of the meat, but it will be more tender once you bread it. Make sure that you don't forget the seasoning. You're gonna need some flour, you're gonna need some egg wash. Egg wash is very easy. You just crack the eggs with an Italian three finger pinch of salt and some pepper as well. That's it. Now, the flour go first, then we have the eggs, then we have the breadcrumb. Now, since I'm all about flavor, one good way to flavor breadcrumb is to mix them with a little Parmesan cheese, grated Parmesan cheese, just like that. And you can save these, you don't need to use them all. You can totally save these. But now, the breading, it's gonna be a life on its own. You're getting your scalpini like that. You put them in flour first. Just like that. Then you put them into the eggs. And notice, men don't like to get dirty with their hands, okay? I'm okay with it, because I'm a chef, but I understand that you, if you wear a suit or some like nice dress or a button up, you don't want, you know, you have a lady coming over. You don't want to get all messy. So you can easily do this with a fork. Look at that. It's perfect. Then you get it like that. Make sure that all the pork is coated with the egg wash. And that's it. Look at this. Could it get any easier? You see that? You see that? Done. One. And now you repeat this for three times. Season the cutlet a little bit more with a touch of pepper. On one side, and then we're gonna season him to the other side. Now what we need to do is to add a little bit of extra virgin olive oil to our saute pan. And now, the cooking part, which is the part I like. When the meat starts to get golden brown, that's your ding-dong alarm to make sure that you understand that if you keep it there, it's gonna burn. You see brown there? Turn it. You see brown there? Turn it. Brown and brown. Perfect. Nice golden brown. Can you hear this? Hear this out. Can you hear it? It's crisp. That's the sound of success when you sear something in a pan. Crisp equal to success. Just make sure that you display your cutlet with some nice arugula, tomato, and a touch of grilled lemon. When you grill citrus, it takes out all the sweetness. You can find tons of tips in the book, or if you can talk to me personally, I would love to give it to you. Drizzle a touch of oil. and you're all set. 
Enjoy. Enjoy.